Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil. Last time, I left you just about right here in this save point room. I said we were going to go do the dog whistle thing at the beginning of this episode, but I decided uh, at the end of last episode after I quit that I wasn't going to... I didn't really... I can't remember why I didn't do it, but what I did is I didn't go back to, to do the basement thing and I didn't save it so anyways regardless I had to redo everything that I did after my last save and so I went and did the basement thing on the way over here and I ended up basically back where I was and I have all the items that I had at the end of the last episode the lighter I burned that body again uh, one thing that happened differently I didn't waste my two bullets that I had left and I also oh, I recombined the green and red herbs that I had and I also did something else what else did I do I did something else um Oh, 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 the zombie that scared me at the end of last episode, like at the very end that came through the door, he fucking didn't even do that this time. So both those zombies are still left in this room. So this time, instead of going up that way, I don't want to waste ammo and try to sneak around those assholes. I'm going to go back this way, which means I'm going to break this doorknob. So I'm going to go ahead and do it. Now, there's two reasons I'm doing this. One is because I don't want to go up by those zombies and waste ammo. The other is I want to actually see what happens in that in the room over here that I avoided remember the room I avoided I'm sure you remember it now in fact which room was it it wasn't this room was it wait the Spencer family emblem is carved onto the doorknob huh is the Spencer family emblem this oh I don't have the emblem shit well we'll figure out what this family emblem is later okay and we've checked that door before but there is a zombie in here I'm gonna try to avoid him since we have a wide hallway here, let's use it. Oh, shit. Goddamn camera angles. Camera angles are not my friend. All right. Go, 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 go. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Smash buttons, smash buttons. Okay. Another good tip that somebody gave me in the comments, smash buttons faster. I was not mashing buttons anywhere near as fast as I am going to from here on out. I think this is the door I went in before. Where I went into that room and I was like, fuck this room. This is this room, right? No? Where am I on the map? What door was that that I said that to? It must have been... Oh. It must have been that door. Well, we're going to go back that way in a second. Let's 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 double check what was out here again. Was there anything else out here? Or was this just like a complete and utter dead end? I don't recall what was out here. Was there anything out here? Holy shit. No! No! Not a dog! Not a dog! No! Did I get him? Shit, reload. Shit, reload. Not a dog, not a dog, not a do Oh, no, 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 not a dog! Anything but a Oh, snap, he just got tased. Yeah, I didn't waste my taser this time either. Did I kill him, though? Shit. Okay. I think I got him. Holy balls. How dare a dog... You know what? Fuck you, dog. For that, we burn your ass. Oh, do we... Why? Can we not? I want to burn the fucking dog. We don't even want to fucks around with the dog. Burn the dog. No, we don't have to burn the dog. We only have to burn human bodies, I guess. Dude, did I come out here before? There's something written in indentation. The defiler of the accursed coffin. Maybe I didn't come out here before. It's locked. Well, of course it is. Well, shit. Maybe I didn't come out here before. Holy shit, that dog scared me. I heard the bushes rustle, and I was like, what's in the bushes? And then all of a sudden, fucking dog. Well then, I think that's a taste of what's to come in this episode, guys, because um, I'm already expecting a dog fight when I blow that whistle. And something tells me if I do that blow, if I blow that whistle in other places, the dog will show its face. Oh, I remember now. I didn't go this way because the zombie. Oh, there's the zombie. There he is. Get off me, bitch. Oh, should I have that knife too? Cool. Oh, great. I wasted my knife and my taser. Awesome. Ah. Well, I didn't do anything, so. If I don't, if I do end up dying from this room, like I think think is gonna happen, well, so be it. I won't have wasted my ammo, or have fought that dog or anything like that. I don't think that dog fighting that dog was absolutely necessary. I really want to see what this room is all about. I I'm I'm having a vague memory of what this room is. I I don't really know what to expect. Let's try to open this door. Oh god, this door opened. Where's this door? Have I opened this door before? Oh shit, why didn't I check this out before? 
Does anybody know why I didn't check this out before? Something got burned. Acrid smell permeates the air. Well, I'm glad I came over here then. Shit. On my way back to the dining room, we run into some interesting stuff, I guess. Assuming that we find anything good in here. I see a dagger, and I think, is that more save point stuff? I'll take the dagger. I could definitely use the D fence. The D E fence. Well positioned silver pitcher. What's that? Yeah, more save ribbons. Three more. Hell yes. Take it in stride, baby. No! No! There's the shotgun. Uh oh. Uh oh. What did I just activate? I took the shotgun, but I feel like I just. A oh! I already get it. You don't even have to tell me, guys. And now I remember why that room is is a bad place. It's all coming back to me now. Not like I actually knew why that room was a bad place. I just remember that room being a bad place. But now I know why it's a bad place. Here we go. I don't know what it does, but I remember this room not being nice. It must have been either a demo I saw or my brother playing. or just I have vague memories of this room. But here we go. I can already see wh where I, why that happened because I grabbed the shotgun off the wall and the game's not going to let me use it. So, can we get to the door? Door won't open. And the door won't open. We are utterly, utterly fucked. You're gonna... Yeah, you're gonna cru be crushed to death, BZ. Oh, what? You in there? Barry? What are you doing over here, Barry? I've been looking for Barry forever. No fucking way. Barry's gonna save our ass? Holy shit. Well, here I was thinking that we had to put the broken shotgun on the thing so that didn't happen. But, never mind? I'm wrong? I guess? Barry. Holy crap. That was a close one. And it's been forever since we've seen a cutscene, too. It fit nicely into a sandwich. Really? Thanks. But Barry, didn't you say you were going back to the dining room to find other clues? I'm glad and all, but why are you here? I just had something I wanted to check. Anyway, we should get back to searching for Wesker and Chris. Something he wanted Thanks, to check. Barry. What does that mean? I owe you one. Don't mention it. Huh. Well, that was certainly an ordeal. I almost want to save it again now that we got the shotgun. And we did just get more ink ribbons. Holy shit. And if we go blow the whistle and fight a dog, I'm not going to be happy about that. So maybe I should go save it again. Um. Yeah, we can't go back in that room. Uh. So yeah. You know what? Fuck. Fuck it. I'm saving that shotgun, too. I don't know what I'm going to use it on. Maybe you guys can uh, tell me what to save it for. Should I, at all costs, save my shotgun ammo? Like, just say yes. Just say yes. And we're passing the door that I want to go in. I want to go in this door. No wonder I didn't go that way before, though. There's a zombie in that hallway, and I didn't see any doors I wanted to check out. Well, shit! We've done a lot more in this episode than I can planned on doing, and I'm definitely going to save it. Hell to the S. More ink ribbons. Hello. I'll go ahead and use that last one I haven't used yet. And then I'll put these three away that I just picked up. And now the broken shotgun. As soon as I saw a use for it, I feel like there is no use for it again. Um, I feel like I lost sound in my headphones. Why did I lose sound in my headphones? Um, This is not cool. Whatever, I'll fix it in a second. I don't know if I lost sound on the recording, but I definitely lost sound on my headphones. Okay, there you go. Sounds back. Sounds back, guys. I was messing with the, the recording device, so I don't know how that sounded on the recording. Luckily, I fixed it within a couple seconds, so it shouldn't be too bad. Saving it again. Hell yes. We got the shotgun, and we saw a cutscene, and we went outside and fought a dog. We are saving all of that. That is a lot of progress, if you ask me. So anyways, do anything I need to drop off here? I'm holding on to that shotgun, hell yes. Anyways, alright, so I guess I'm going to go up and around and contend with these two zombies again. I I don't see a way around that. I, uh, wait, I do have a dagger though, do I not? 
So I can use the dagger to get by and then just run. Sounds like the best idea, so let's just do that. Let's be quick about it. Be quick about it. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, that's how you do it. That's how you do it. I was kind of hoping I could do that. I kind of shaked and baked him. If you run fast enough through a room, you can just shake and bake zombies. Oh, shit, forgot about that guy, though. Yeah, so there's still a zombie in this hallway now. He didn't get tased like he did last time. So just remember that for future reference. Otherwise, let us head back to the dining room. I am excited. And there's actually one thing I want to do in the dining room now that I think about it. Uh, mm. Remember at the end of last, or near the end of last episode. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Cutscene. Hold on. Jill, got any good news? Other than I'm still alive in this madhouse? No. Can't say it's much safer here either. We'd better secure our escape route first. There's got to be a back door somewhere. All right then, let's split up again. Hey, hold on a sec. Look what I've found. What? Something cool? A can of fizz. It's sure to yellow and mellow those things. It's yours. Hopefully you won't have to use it. Can of fizz? Acid shells. That sounds good. For a shotgun, I'm guessing? What about you? Oh, don't worry. I like the buddy system we have here. <laughs> I see. Thanks. I'll take it. See you later. Ciao. So, are those shotgun shells? Um, um, it seems like that. I mean, they had the same amount of ammo as a shotgun as I have right now. Acid shells. Let me examine them just to be sure. Shells for the grenade... Wait, what? Shells for the grenade launcher? What grenade launcher? I don't have a fucking grenade launcher. I want a grenade launcher now. Game? Don't tease me like that. You can't just say there's a for a grenade launcher that you don't have. That's not cool, man. That is not cool. Anyways, as I was trying to say before that cutscene happened out of nowhere, I was going to come up in this beast right here, and we're going to deal with the statue issue. And I see what to do now. Now, if you notice, right where the statue is, or near where the statue is, it's not right next to it, there's this, there's this opening right here, right? I'm going to try and push the statue off the opening. I don't know what that's going to do, but I'm going to see what it does. You can thank my coworker for that one though. My coworker was actually watching my episode of this today at work and he was like, "Don't you see the opening in the landing?" And I'm like, "No. Oh, that. Oh. I mean, seeing as how I ran into the statue on accident last episode and my controller was being a douche, I I wasn't exactly sure what I could do with the statue. Now that I noticed it and I see it for myself, I realize what to do. So, spoiler or not, I understand what to do with the statue now. Now this is where we have to blow the dog whistle as well, as well. This room somewhere. I don't know if we have to do it in front of this stained glass window. But we'll do it in a second. First I'm going to deal with the statue and see what happens. Hopefully it unlocks something cool. That'd be, that'd be nice to find something cool. Not that we haven't already in this episode. I found the freaking shotgun. Hello. I feel really dumb for not finding the shotgun before now. That's freaking amazing. I'll take the shotgun any day. I'm going to push this a little bit more. And now we're going to push it off the ledge. Hopefully we can do this before the zombie comes over here and eats my ass. Push, motherfucker. And... I don't know what that did, but we're going to go downstairs and find the fuck out. That's for damn sure. And then we'll try out the whistle. I'm not exactly scared to fight a dog now that I have a shotgun and a handgun. Hell yes. And we're definitely going to use up our handgun ammo before we even touch the shotgun ammo. And like I said, let me know what's best to use the shotgun on, or do I just use it and does it matter? Are we gonna get more ammo for it? I guess that's a good. I guess that's a good another valid question. Is more ammo for the shotgun available? I'm sure it is. There's no way in hell they just give you one set of shotgun ammo and never again. Anywho, so we just we threw. Oh, we could save it again in here now. That I think about it. Whatever. What is this? It's blue. It's shiny. What is it? It's a blue gemstone. Looks like a freaking chaos emerald from, from freaking, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. Anybody? <laughs> blue gemstone. We're gonna examine this immediately. Shiny. What does it do? It's beautifully cut and polished to a mirror-like surface. Okay. That's cool. I. I honestly have no fucking clue what that could possibly be for. I kind of wish I kept 
some of those ink ribbons now, and I also kind of wish I dropped off something. I don't know. I have a full thing now, but I don't know. I honestly don't know what I could have dropped off. I wish there's an item box in here next to this ammo, or in this save point. There's no item box in here though. Because if there was, I would drop some shit off. But there isn't one. Well, whatever. I don't expect to die right now. I have a healing. I got a thing to heal with. I got enough weaponry. We're about to fight a dog. And I'd rather fight the dog down here than up there. So let's see what happens if I blow the whistle right now. I'm going to keep my eye on that window up there, and we're going to do it right now. Here we go. Ready? You guys ready for this? Deep breath. Prepare to be... Prepare your buttholes. Not necessary to use this now. Okay, well then maybe I have to use it up there by the window. Never mind. I didn't realize the dog whistle was something it would only let you use at the right time. I thought it was going to be something I could use whenever I want. And now that I think about it, I almost want to kill the zombie up there on the landing. Because if I have to fight a dog up there, that zombie's only going to be... Prove as a distraction and be in the way. A roadblock, if you will. And I ain't got time for no roadblocks, bitch. Whatever. We'll just see what happens when I blow the whistle by the window. If a, zo if a dog comes and I die, oh, so be it. I just hope it's not a pack of fucking dogs. With, like, a pack with a leader. Ugh, that would be... That'd be overkill, in my opinion. So where's this bitch? All right, let's let him. Let's let him kind of find his way over this way. Just go ahead, zombie. Do your thing, zombie. Do your thing. Make sure he's coming toward me. Come on, zombie. Do your thing. I'm gonna run as quickly as I can to that side. All right, ready and go! Run faster, Jill. Run faster. All right, here we go. Time to blow a whistle. Blow my whistle, bitch. What? Not necessary now. Then where the fuck do we use it? Um. Where the fuck do we use it? Cause if not now, then when? <sighs> we got that gemstone too. What the fuck do I do with that gemstone? I don't even know right now. Where can I go? Like, let's check the map. Let's make sure I've checked everywhere now. Now that I've checked those areas, where else can I go? Let's see. I've gone to the end of that hallway on the right... On the right side of the mansion. I, and that was just an empty room that needed, like, a, a... Something. I can't remember what I needed to get in there, but I needed something. Now, on the left side of the second floor, that goes up to the other area where that key was. That... The key that... It's like the mansion key, right? Where the spikes came and stabbed me to death. I don't think there's anything else to do up there. Where else can I go? I'm a little bit flabbergasted by where else I can go. Huh. Why does it look like that door on the on that inside isn't even open? I'm going to go make sure it's open. I feel like the door on the inside should be open. Maybe oh, maybe we have to go outside. Like let's go outside over here. This door right here. Let's check this door. Maybe it is out here. It would make most sense if we do it outside. Anyway, let's be careful out here for sure. We're on the second floor, so we're not in too much of a too much of a danger. Wait, is this a shiny thing on the ground? Was this on the ground? No, 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 not that. There's a shiny thing on the ground right here. What is this? What is this? This was not here before, was it? No, that's that's not what I'm trying to grab. There's a shiny thing right there. Jill? Jill. You're not cooperating. There's a shiny thing literally right there. Can you... Is that, is that seriously not a thing? Are you kidding me right now? That's not a thing. Of all things that are not things, that's not a thing. You gotta be kidding me right now. Whatever, I'm going to look around out here for just a minute. Just to double check that there's nothing else out here. Then I'm going to make sure this door over here is unlocked, because it should be. I don't know why it's not. I swear I've, I have I did this already when I saved it. Or maybe maybe the one time I did not did die, I didn't come back through this door to make sure. I don't remember. It's hard to remember for sure. Anyway, that door is now unlocked forever. Just making sure. I could have sworn I unlocked that door before. I mean, like, you guys saw me unlock the door. I definitely did it. But I guess I didn't do it on one of the times when I saved it. 
All right, well, whatever. Let's go over here where the stained glass window is, and we're gonna use we're gonna use the powers of the dog whistle and see what happens. Hopefully, it fucking works this time. I'm ready to fight. You blew the dog whistle. Uh oh, we're in the right area now. Oh snap! Oh snap! Oh, you fucks. Oh, you fucks. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Holy shit, there's two of them. Give me the shotgun. I don't want to waste all my handgun ammo and I can just blow these motherfuckers away. Check it. Oh, shit. No, get off. Get off. Get off. Get off. Get off. Get off. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. I'm pressing the wrong button. Shit, I need to eat. I need to eat. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Okay, cool. That healed me. Now, yes! Eat my shotgun, bitch. Woo! That's what I should have done in the first place. Holy shit, guys. All right, put the handgun back on before you waste your shotgun ammo. All right, what do we got? Is that his collar? Yes. Yes, I will take that collar, and I'll examine it in a moment. Let me make sure the other dog didn't get, drop anything. This one had a chain on him, huh? Yeah, he did. Well, then. We have sufficiently killed three dogs. Are you proud? Oh! I ate my herb, but I could have healed over here. I just thought about that. I wonder if this healing spot is, like, forever usable. Damn it. Oh, well. Let's examine this shit see if it's, like, a one-time examine. Because we're supposed to examine. I think this little... He has something, like, in his collar. I can't remember what they said it was. Some emblem, right? The coin was hidden in the collar. Yay, the coin. There's nothing unusual about the coin. Oh, yeah? That looks unusual to me. It's a goddamn key. The imitation of a key. Okay. It's shaped like a key, but lacks the rigidity to be used as one. Huh. Well, it's definitely in the shape of something we could probably use. Maybe we gotta combine it with something? I'm not entirely certain yet. But it's good to have it. I, I don't know what it's for yet. Same with this gemstone. What the fuck is the gemstone gonna be for? It's so random. Anyway, we got a gemstone, we got a key, we used our dog whistle. I don't know if we'll ever need that thing again. I'm probably going to go put the dog whistle away. Yeah, I don't need to use those now. You probably don't need this dog whistle anymore. Yep, I was just thinking I didn't need it anymore, and the game told me so. So thank you, game, for giving me the heads up, bro. I appreciate it. I appreciate the heads up. I almost feel like saving it again. I know I'm getting overkill on the saves, but I got items I don't really want to carry around right now. We're okay. Now that I've done that, though, where else can I go? I got this key now. Where can this key take me? <sighs> All the door locks say armor. They say helmet. They say uh, armor and helmet. I think there was a sword on one of them. I wonder if uh, this key is the shape of a sword. I'm kind of curious to find one of the doors that said it needs the shape of a sword and see if it works. I'm very curious. Run, bitch, run. Run, bitch, run. We're, we're going back to the Great Hall regardless. Um, I really do want to get to a point where I can save it again before I end this episode now that I've discovered this key. I don't remember what the key was for. He's, it's said in the book, when I, or I think it's said in the book. The book, or not the book, but the memo when I picked up the dog whistle. I mean, if you guys don't tell me, I'll just look at my old episode and reread the memo if I have to. But we don't look shit up in this. We don't look shit up in this playthrough. You heard me. It's locked. An emblem of a helmet. Emblem of a helmet. Imitation of a key. Examine it again. Lacks the rigidity to be used as one. Zoom in. Huh. Well then. Because we made it into that form, I'm assuming... You know what? Do you think it unlocks this back here? I'm afraid as fuck to go down here. But... Do we have the lock key for it? There are octagonal indentations to the right and the left of the door. Octagonal. Well, that thing we picked up was octagonal before I pressed the button and made it a key. Does that mean anything? No fucking clue. One other thing I want to check in this room. There was that statue with the shiny thing on it. I never did figure out how to get that. There's got to be a way. There's got to be a fucking way. This shiny thing up there, man. I'm super dying to figure out how to get that shit. There's got to be something in here to help you get it. 
oil photograph is in the frame. Maybe this person was connected to the mansion somehow. I think I may have looked at that before. See, one thing my, my friend, my coworker was telling me is that this room is different. Because he said there was an easy way to get that thing up there. Maybe that's the thing that he was thinking of that's easy to get it with just isn't in this room or isn't in this room yet. Or maybe he's tripping. Maybe we can push this shit. Yeah, I know you're over there, zombie. You ain't you ain't gonna scare me again. I really wish I could figure out how to get that thing down. Woman drawing water. Is there literally nothing I can use to like get that shit down? I honestly don't see anything, so I'm not gonna I'm not I'm not gonna waste ammo trying to shoot it down, I'll tell you that much right now. Now what was this room over here? This room is actually the way I think I wanna go, because I actually wanna go and look around down that hallway again. Yeah, I kind of want to go this way. I'm trying to remember what was all this direction. I checked all the doors, though. Wait. Maybe that outside area that I went to at the beginning of this episode? Maybe I can go there now. Maybe that key can unlock something out there. Let's, let's go this way anyways. I don't even remember what this hallway had in it. I don't remember this hallway at all, actually. Oh yeah, I do. That fucking window scared the shit out of me. Now I remember. It's all coming back to me now. Once you get the shit scared out of you once, you remember where that happened forever. Goddamn shit scaring out of me game. Wait, what? I can push this? Somebody in my comments told me I can push stuff. Like, stuff I've come across. And I was like, what stuff is he talking about? I see something behind here too. Oh hell yeah, I'm pushing this. Hell yeah. Pushing. What did I see? Oh, ammo. Yes. I will take ammo any day, baby. Any day. Hell yeah. And we're about to go to our item box like right now. So that works out quite nicely. Quite nicely. Indeed. Indeed. Now, what was in here again? Oh, okay. Wh which hallway is this before I like make a fool of myself again? All right. So this is the hallway. Oh, this is where the bathroom was, right? Like, this is the bathroom right here? Let me just double check the bathroom. I think this was the bathroom, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, no, this was outside. Oh, the bathroom is that room I'm talking about, but this leads outside. I don't remember the... What the fuck? Oh, God, there's dogs out here. Oh, that's right, I remember seeing those bastards. Well, my guns are ready if I need to fight them. But I wanted to look out here again. There was something out here, wasn't there? Something that required a light. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Fuck you, Zog! Fuck you, dog! Oh, you fuck! Oh, you fuck! Fucking dog. Eat my fucking shit. I'm a little worried that that dog's gonna get in here too, but let's see what's out here again. There's plenty of kerosene. Okay. This is where we can get some more kerosene. A boulder humidity is causing it to rust. Um, I feel like there's got to be something else we can do out here. It's such a useless area. I'm so afraid of that goddamn dog being right there too. Ugh, I hate that I wasted some more ammo, but whatever. Every dog we kill, the better. One less dog I got to fight later. That's for damn sure. And we're about to head to the save point now anyway, so I'm okay with killing another thing. Especially if it only used, costed me four bullets for something that was basically unavoidable. You can't really avoid those dogs. They fucking tackle your ass. Wait. Where am I at now? I thought this was the... Is this the... Okay, this is the bathroom. I was saying, maybe... Isn't this the bathroom? It is. Indeed, this is the bathroom. Just double checking that there was nothing else in here. I don't remember. Yeah. Just double check it, guys. I know I've been here before. But I want to be as thorough as possible. I don't want to miss anything. Any, especially things I might have to go back in rooms I've been to before. Always good to not miss things if you can avoid it. Anyways. Alright, so. Just double checking my map because I thought it, I, I knew where I was going. Yeah, I do. I'm just. Oh, because this hallway keeps going, right? Yeah, okay. That's where I was. That's where I got confused. There is a zombie in here. I know there is. We already know this. What's this wall? I feel like there should be more in here. Whatever. 
Let me make sure I'm not missing the door I want to go in. Oh, we definitely won't miss the door. The zombie's in the next hallway. That's the room where they almost got healed with the shotty gun. Don't worry, I know where I am now. I can't believe how much progress I've made in this episode. I'm like proud of myself currently because I'm like thinking, here I am thinking, oh man, hopefully I get something done today. And there's actually, there's this door. The Spencer family emblem is carved into the knob. Maybe that's this key. Not necessary. Well, okay then. Well, you know what I'm going to do since we're going to go to the save point right now? I'm going to see if I can friggin', um, what you call it? Do some, do some combining of items. I don't see why the hell not. See if I can create maybe an emblem of something that'll resemble something I can get through a door maybe? I don't know. We're about, about, about ready to wrap up this episode anyway. So let's do some combinations before we end the episode. And then we'll go ahead and save it and end this shit. So anyways, let's put this, uh... Let's put the these grenade things away. Mostly because we don't have any goddamn grenade launchers. What the hell, man? Grenade launcher? Are you crazy right now? And we'll put the ammo away for a moment because I'm going to pull out some shit to try and do some combinations. We're going to bring out the shotgun because uh, if it's not for the part where I get the shotgun, then where else is it for? I mean, it might actually be for the part where you get the shotgun, and I just fucked up. But we'll find out. Anyways, let's try and combine some of this shit and see what happens. Combine with this. Combine with that. Combine with that. Nothing. Okay. Let's try to combine this with this. Or this. Or this. Okay, that did nothing. What if I should... Have I examined this closely before? I feel like I should have. There's nothing unusual. It's galled around the outer edges due to the frequent fitting. Huh. Maybe I should, like, make sure there's no other, like, things about it that I should be looking at. I guess not. Well, um, no, 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 no. Huh. I don't really have anything else to try and combine shit together with either, do I? I also have no more healing items. Oh, other than the first aid spray in here, but yeah. Well, uh, if, all right, here's the questions I'll pose right now. Sh broken shotgun. Is the only use for it? Uh, to take place of the other shotgun so that room doesn't come and crush you? Or is there another use and that was just too obvious? And I guess, other than that, I don't know what else to say. Like, this gemstone doesn't seem useful to me at all. I will keep the key because the key was like main story. I had to get it. But everything else just seems completely separate. I just don't see anything I can combine. Maybe give me a clue on something I can maybe be able to combine to help me? That might help. I, I don't know. Wait. Oh, I didn't get the ink ribbons out. I was going to save it. Because this is actually where we're going to end the episode. I think this is a pretty good spot. I actually didn't die at all, did I? Here I was thinking I was going to die the whole time. And I don't think I died once today. Impressive, right? Impressive. So anyways, that's going to conclude this episode of Let's Play Resident Evil. Hope you guys enjoyed some more progress. And I will see you guys next time for some more fucking shit pants. Wedding. Bedness. Shut up. I'll see you guys then. Peace.